Hey guys, I'm Tiffany Dunham, author of The Eighth Pawn and Swat the Fly, and today I wanted to come and tell you about Corduroy. This is a book that was written and illustrated over 50 years ago by Don Freeman, and it's all about a bear named Corduroy that lives in a department store and is waiting for someone to come and buy him. So here he is with all the other toys. Well, Lisa and her mother come, and Lisa really wants corduroy, but the mother says, not today. We've spent too much money already, and besides, look at his button. It's missing. Okay, well, corduroy did not realize he was missing a button, but now he realizes it. So that night, he wanders around the department store searching for his missing button. He ends up upstairs in the furniture department, and he finds a mattress that has buttons. So he pops one off thinking it might be his. In the process, he knocks over this lamp and alerts the night watchman with that noise. So the night watchman comes down from above, the floor above, to see what's going on. And he finds Corduroy hiding in bed and brings him back down to all the other toys. Well, the next morning, Lisa had gathered up all of her money and comes to buy him because she wanted him that badly. So she brings him home where she has the perfect size bed for him right next to hers. And he realizes that this is his home. He's finally found it. And even though she says that she likes him just the way he is, she's gonna, she sews on a new button for him because he'll be more comfortable that way. Um, and in the end, it just says, you must be a friend, said Corduroy. I've always wanted a friend. Me too, said Lisa, and gave him a big hug. And that's the only time that they actually talk to one another. Otherwise, um, it's as if no one can hear him throughout the book. Uh, but very cute. We've had this uh, many times in our house from the library, and it wasn't until my daughter's birthday that we just got it to add to our shelf. Uh, but it's one I loved as a child, and now my kids love it, and I enjoy reading it to them. So if you've got kids, it's probably one you guys will enjoy too. Check it out, and be sure to like and subscribe so you can hear more great book recommendations.